hello guys and welcome to my channel once again hi guys so welcome after a very very long time i know it's been a while like over three to four months i've not been online and i actually owe you all my wonderful people explanation and apology i sincerely apologize for the long silence and for the explanation i will explain okay so my camera got spoiled and the phone i was using the camera was way 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 bad so i had to like be on hold for a long time thank god i got a better phone at least with a better camera not the best camera but at least manageable one that's what i'm using now to record then i'm sorry i have to just use these nights and see this video is actually unscripted unplanned and it's just that i felt let the 2020 not just close down without me um, posting anything at all that's why i had to film this so please you manage whatever you see actually i have some visitors on the um, on today's episode just not really but we still have different visitors share so welcome back to my channel and please if you're yet to subscribe do all well to help me subscribe to the channel do all well to share like and please comment at the comment section so basically today we'll be talking about the year 2020 let me say it's going to be a very short video so um it's kind of summary of what 2020 um is all about all the all the things like 2020 is a year to be remembered you know when i was growing up i've always heard of vision 2020 vision 2020 and all of that so i hoped for for 2020 and it came guys it's really brought a lot of things it's brought a lot of pains a lot of tears a lot of laughter a lot of new inventions and all of that so the year 2020 came with a lot when i mean a lot i mean a lot so how did my year 2020 start okay it started well from january to february early march it was going on well until asu decided to bah, strike and when asu strike at first they said two weeks so um two weeks warning strike or so so we're managing the two weeks so we use that two weeks to rest a little hmm, guys just when we're putting hope that asu will call us back that was when we started hearing covid 19 has entered nigeria before we say jack robinson bang COVID-19 has entered lockdown and so many activities were put on hold, like on hold. But then some people actually made good use of the um, corona whatever period and it was kind of nice. I as a person really made good use of that lockdown period and I know most of my friends who have become CEOs today during that lockdown because it gave us time to actually sit, think, and, you know, invent new things, get new ideas and all of that. So the lockdown period was actually, it was fun sort of, and it was a period where families have to sit together for a whole week. You know what it means? No going out, everybody in the home, everybody showing his or her true colors and all of that. So... Uh, the lockdown was actually i don't know it's good it's though it's really affected us negatively and all of that so many people lost their job ah do, do, do. well we thank god so yeah 2020 came with a lot like a lot i don't even know where to start from but let's hear from our few um visitors i'll be chipping in while they talk I actually asked them to describe, uh, like, explain what 2020 is in their own opinion based on the happenings and everything. And we have like um, three to four people who have sent in their views, and you will be listening. So please just stay tuned. 2020 tune. has been a crazy year, not just for me, but at least most of the people around me. 
from their descriptions of how they had a lot of plans for 2020, Vision 2020, and then Corona came in, lockdown, ASU strike, Black Lives Matter, NSAS. 2020 was just a lot. But for me personally, I would say 2020 is like one of my best uh, this year has not been very funny for me. It's quite challenging, very difficult. I could not do business. I need to travel to do a lot of things, especially business engagement. I could not. Of course, uh, the lockdown, you know, one cannot go for hangout, cannot go see family and friends, cannot go and do a lot of things. But uh, my hope is still very strong. I'm still very hopeful. I believe that with God, all things are going is possible, of course. And god will see us through please let's keep the faith strong and let's pray for ourselves and let's do the right thing keep the COVID 19 measures precautionary measures and let's see what god will do thank you i as i said earlier year 2020 actually came with a lot of things and a lot of things to remember guys you can't forget 2020 isn't it we really saw division 2020. yeah 2020 for me was a year of was an exceptional year it was a year filled with um many challenges yet unimaginable um achievements it was also a year of cruising for me because it, a lot of battles were won fought and won on my behalf and i was just cruising cruising through enjoying the victory god has won for me it was a year filled with um, many risks, health-wise, finances, financial risk, and any other kind of risk we could um, think of. But we thank God, here we are. I'm so happy and grateful because myself and my family went through this year and here we are on scars. Yes, I lost some people. Not like we're very close, but I, I will still miss them. So, lessons learned and... Um, 2020 has been a very fruitful year, a very amazing one, a very, very dramatic one to say. Full of tears, full of frustration, depressions, blessings somewhat, and you know, so many amazing goodies just to say a few. Yes, yeah, so despite how your 2020 might have gone, it's a perfect opportunity to still be grateful for life. Because if you actually take a look back um, at what um, the situation has been so far from one problem to another, but yet, yet, I mean, you still have the opportunity to be alive. It's something worth to be thankful for. So why not walk into 2021 with full of smiles, full of happy? So guys, we've heard from others, other people's view of the year 2020. It was actually a um, great year and also a painful year. A lot of things happened. Personally, I have... Okay, I lost my father this year, 2020. I lost a classmate. I lost some friends, some relatives, and so on. So it's actually... A sad one for me and at the same time I gained a lot of things like when I mean a lot of things I mean a lot of things so this is one of my greatest achievements also for the year 2020 of which I'll tell you all about it some other time but we thank God for the year 2020 and we hope that 2021 will be better it will be fun actually so thank you for watching this video and please don't forget to kindly subscribe, to share, to like and comment at the comment section. So those people gave us their own view of year 2020. Please, I want to hear your own view, your own perfect description of year 2020. Happy New Year in advance. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in 2021.